up YouTube Matthew here once again with another video for you all and in today's video I will be discussing how the Black Panther movie can help your e-commerce business your online business uh, your Shopify dropshipping business so before we go on be sure to subscribe down below turn on that notification bell and like this video and comment down below if you have any questions, concerns, any negative or positive uh, aspects of this video, just let me know down below. Now, how can the Black Panther movie or things that the directors and marketers did in that movie can help your online business? Now, the number one thing that I saw that went well with that movie is that number one, they knew their target audience. They knew their demographic. Now, Black Panther, they they knew their demographic uh, and, and they really amplified that through their movie. They made sure they didn't sway to the left or to the right with it or anything. They knew their target audience, which was the black culture, uh, African, um, you know, traditions and things like that. And them as director, the director himself was black, so he knew the concerns that his black audience would uh, think of. And so like even with the characters of, of choosing actors, like he could have chose, um, you know, different actors with, uh, this may be an example, but it's true, like lighter shade, um, different texture of hair. And the director said he made sure that all of them had natural hair, like the women or even no hair. You know, and so like that's really good with marketing, not only with the film itself, but with marketing itself. It's just really knowing your audience and really able to tap into their interests and connect with them on that level. And so when you have a set audience, you know, and they love your product, they love what you're doing, you can be good forever. I mean, that that helped Donald Trump so much. I mean, he he has a core group of people that stick with him no matter what he says, no matter what he does. And that's what happened with Black Panther too, uh, with, with uh, targeting mostly African Americans. But to me, it's broader than that. It's Marvel in general, it's superheroes, but like really targeting black culture, um, just having your set, pro um, your set um, target is really important. And that goes for anything with your online business. For example, if you're selling African garb or things like that would have been a perfect time to do that. You know, you have a set audience, you have hype around the product, you have, we're in February, which is Black History Month. Um, it would have been a good idea to sell those type of clothing, be like, hey, wear this on your, on the premiere of Black Panther. Hey, do this, do that. So when you really have your set audience or your set demographic, uh, um, it's really it's really good it makes the online business simpler because you don't have to worry about targeting oh i need to target this group of people or that group of people no you're just targeting one group of people and don't and don't care about the other groups of people hating you or liking you you have your set audience and stick with it you know and that that helps so whether you're blogging or making videos or um just selling products online like i am through shopify uh, that aspect of Black Panther can help you. Now, number two is that they put a lot of hype, good marketing uh, behind the film. And I will tell you a few examples of what they did and how you can implement that in your online business. Now, number one, you know, I watch a lot of YouTube videos um, and I always saw interview with Michael B. Jordan, interview with the cast of Black Panther. You saw all these actors going on so many interviews um, leading up to the movie and, and during the movie and after the movie premiered. Um, and so they created the hype and people like people who weren't necessarily interested in seeing it, they probably saw an interview with one of their favorite hosts that got them interested in seeing it. You know, getting going to you know, to different audiences, targeting them from different angles. And um, that produced a lot of hype and just the the social climate with, you know, the race relations and everything in this um, time that that produced the hype. And now you have a movie with all black cast with it. Um, and so 
just the hype that they create in marketing through um, having the actors interview. So a way that you could do that is um, using Instagram influencers, putting hype behind your product. Uh, a person may not necessarily like your product until an influencer has it. And that's really important that you take that into account because now instead of targeting, let's say black people, you're targeting people, Asian people who like anime, but you're using that person to promote your product, you know? And so now you have that group of people liking your product or interested in your product. So create hype. And whether that's running Facebook ads and letting somebody see it like four or five times in their mind, in their timeline, even though they're skipping it the first, second time, they know your product, they're interested in it. Now they're gonna click it. Now they're gonna be like, okay, what else do they sell? So just create the hype behind your product or whatever online business you're doing. Number three is that Black Panther <laughs> had a really good product. You know, they had a good movie. I saw it yesterday. It was a, it was a great movie, amazing movie. Uh, my review of it is it was a good superhero film, like despite any other symbolism and, uh, you know, hidden messages and how it relate to this you know today's social climate um it was a good superhero film with action and a good storyline like the story was good like with the cousin and the family and everything you know and the acting was a plus like you know no flaws in the acting skills at all um yeah and so they had a good product and so they delivered you know, based off their demographics, they knew their target audience. They knew, okay, they would be thinking this. They Their expectations are this and that. You know, a black person would not want to see a quote-unquote whitewashed Black Panther, okay? They want to see some real dark-skinned melanin uh, people in that movie, and they deliver that. And, or, or you know they just knew their audience and they really delivered and they created that hype around it and they just had a good product and so with you whether it's a blog or vlog you know whether it's just creating content but putting it having standards to it at every level i mean your standards now may not be your standards in a year or now so you have to understand that and so uh, creating the greatest product that you can at the moment you know is your start so whether that's getting good quality products from your online business um, through aliexpress and then you know when you move on you, you go more domestically okay now i'm going to buy them bulk and have control of the, over the quality of the product or service uh, then you can move on so those are the three things how um, black panther and their success you know they made over 360 million dollars worldwide in three days like it's easily gonna pass a billion dollars within a month, um, which is incredible. Um, and so, um, and you know, it's just learning how they market. Like to me, I was just thinking about the marketing, you know, having an online business and seeing like, oh my goodness, this is gonna, they're gonna make so much money from this. Like you already know, like when you have a set, like the main thing is really having a set group of people, you know, having that demographic, like you could sell anything. But it's just, even if you're like a white or black person, but your target audience is like specifically like Koreans or something, and they don't know that you're Korean. Let's say you just have an online website, but it's like so Korean, they're gonna love it no matter what, you know? Because if you make it super Korean or something like that. Um, but um, yeah, so I hope you all enjoyed this video. Be sure to subscribe, uh, comment down below, like this video, and yeah, Wakanda.